Lower Brule is not alone. Like many Native American reservations, the people here have complex health care needs. We have a lot of needs that are, you know, systemically involved where we are lacking the professional um, the professionals to meet those needs and the financial piece to meet the transportation and those things. Ellen Durkin oversees mental health and social services here in Lower Brule. She says while it is critical to have in town, it is tough for the two mid-level providers in the community to handle all the health care needs. That means they often look outside of the reservation for services. Many of those folks on the furthest edges of Fort Thompson or Lower Brule uh, would have to drive, you know, 80, 90 miles, 100 miles if we weren't here to provide services. They would have to go that much further. And, and when you're talking about just basic access to care uh, or an emergency room, 100 miles gets to be a long ways to drive. Like Lower Brule, Chamberlain is along the Missouri River. The communities are 45 minutes apart. Because of its location, Sanford Chamberlain Medical Center serves the people of two reservations. About 50% of those who come here are Native American. And we do have a lot of high risk labor and delivery as a result of that. Uh, secondarily then, um, chronic diseases, diabetes, uh, kidney failure, um, hypertension, CHF, all those types of uh, diagnoses and, and chronic illness are, are more prevalent here. All those conditions make medical services here all the more critical. It's why the relationship between the tribal community and medical center has no end in sight. They know our families, they assist with whatever needs, you know, that are above our capabilities. And because we don't have an emergency room, we don't have 24-hour acute care, we, we have our own ambulance service, so we do rely heavily on the Sanford unit in Chamberlain. I'm Sean Neistead for Sanford Health News.